This is number 3,129 of 5,300 made in 04 to 05 before the plant burned down. This is, which is, which is, is true. Is that why they stopped making them? <laughs> yeah, th- that's, yeah. Did not the know second that. plane has hit the plant. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> We're going to look at the NB Miata. Like begging, begging for us to look at NBs. There's a guy that's been haranguing us constantly to look at these, so we're going to do it. Atlas says it's the best generation. I own one. I strongly disagree that this could possibly be the best generation of Miata. <laughs> well, but all right, wait, wait, let me, let me, let me. Put a let me put a bookman on that. A it's caveat. the best looking generation, but everybody knows the NC is the best driving generation. It just has that stupid looking smiley face. For the budget ones, I would agree the NC is absolutely the way to go. I will also agree with you; it's the best looking one. I used to be a big NA fan, but honestly, the curves on this thing are all right. On the NB or the NC? No, the NB. NB. Oh, the NC looks yeah. Like NB looks stupid. fine. Yeah, the NC, the NC's got a weird look to it, and everybody kind of agrees on that, I think. I've said it, I've said it before, but the NC looks like the hot girl in high school that kind of let herself go. Yes. And you saw her again, and, <laughs> you know, she still you she still has a pretty face, but you can tell she chonked up. Yeah, you, you just kind of laugh to yourself about how she's looking nowadays. Yeah. yeah. Check, her, check her out on Facebook every, like, oh, every six you're, months. You're not a flyer anymore. You're a base for sure this time. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus Christ. That's a cheerleader joke. So anyway, here's a 2001 Mazda Miata five hours ago in El Paso, Texas. 4,500 bucks, 198,000 miles. It's got coilovers. It's got a spare transmission and clutch. No title. All right, that's enough. So right. 4,500 bucks for a no title and For a no title. With 200,000 no. miles. No. no. Downvote. Downvote, move on. This is work we don't need what? to. It, look at the wing in the passenger seat. Yeah, it's just hang. He couldn't put the car cover on with the wing on, so he had to take it off. Idiot. This is the worst deal we're going to see, I think. I you hope think? so. I really hope so. This sucks. Here is a 2004 Mazda MX-5 Miata LS convertible, $6,000, four hours ago in Malden, Massachusetts. 67,000 miles. They're Malden, dude. First I one's have, a better deal. I've been there, and never again. I'll take that one for forty five hundred. You're out of your Honestly. damn mind. <laughs> <laughs> Fifteen hundred more dollars gets you under a hundred thousand miles and not a complete piece of shit. I think that mm-hmm. this is a great deal without any yeah. information whatsoever. And it's better with no information because uh, maybe that'll scare people off, but... Yeah, go look. Yeah, there's this is high, high up on the look at it scale. Yeah, I'd give that a, a solid thumbs up. Yeah. yeah. Go take a look. At the very least to look at it. It's a definite call this guy and schedule an appointment. 100%. Maybe you'll go see it and find out that it's or something but like <laughs> Man, I hate you gotta look at it. And look, you, he has you the can car see that from here dude but <laughs> he has the yeah. car fact it's got the car fox yeah look at that and all he's showing you is retail value is that really the retail value on these is right it? now mm-hmm. huh. no. why are NA so with, much more expensive oh hold up though? stop total loss and accident reported with a $9,000 retail value so it's salvage that's why he's not showing you the top these are worth Wait. more if it's a clear title than $9,150 <laughs> No, I can't believe it's salvage. The the, the car fox is out of its down mind. It's what's throwing off is that um Yeah, yeah, you're the, right. The mileage, it's throwing off the uh the algorithm there. So no, this guy's out of his goddamn mind. All right, so we got a salvage title. Good catch, Poochie. Yeah. It looks nice uh, for a salvage. Maybe it was a flood. Even yeah, even then. Nah, Who not cares? even then. I don't I don't f- salvage titles, bro. Here's a 1999 Miata, 111,000 miles with an automatic transmission. This is a private sale, not a public one. A rebuilt title. Yeah, a rebuilt title in Georgia. Yeah, never mind. Fuck it. All right. It's junk. Another another sale is three for three on something's wrong with the title. Gross. Trying to talk some shit? Discord.gg slash feed. Let's talk some shit, bitch. Give me. All new sticker designs and our classics are available at collectorcarfeed.com slash store. A paint shot on this one. I just, I don't like the green and tan combination. Oh, like a classic, the classic about. British racing yeah. combo. I, I so love it. the best combo. Yeah, I like Green I like with tan interior. Hate, hate the tan. That's, that's the only time I'll accept a tan interior. Same. That's the way to go. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry you're wrong, Road Atlas. Yeah, God. Realize, I didn't realize I was immediately wrong. Jesus. Imbecile. <laughs> <laughs> Imbecile. Anyway, nobody wants this anyway. Damn, is that a yeah, that is a saline Mustang? Sheesh. You're still stuck on Honolulu, so we're seeing I've never, all this shit. <laughs> this is I've in never Georgia. seen I've never seen a convertible top with a sunroof. There we go. All right, well now it's oh, gone. Yeah. A bunch of, what the f dude? <laughs> 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 Yo, Can I go up. back? Please? Holy shit. <laughs> 
<laughs> Why is there an ass? A doll <laughs> ass. <laughs> yeah, welcome to my uh, welcome to every day in the ATL, man. Vertible top and a, a sunroof. Yeah, when you need just a little bit less wind in your hair. Christ. All right. So here's a, no, this is a saline Mustang. <laughs> Fuck. The ass on this, they add, they add more ass to the saline, and it's kind of hot. Fuck yeah. So much ass. Extra ass. Bad to the bone. Ass for days. Pog Mustang, dude. Look how thick. Damn. It usually stops here. Mm-mm. It looks like a Cuda from the back. Yeah, is that a Land Cruiser 60 series? Yeah. Right here. Base choice nice. in vehicles. What's that yellow yeah. car in the garage, though? What do you think? Looks like a Viper. That's what I was going to say, yeah. It's yeah, like a Viper with a tented windshield. This guy's cool as f- could be his friend. He's got an off-road frontier in Hawaii. Well, I mean, yeah, actually, if you do the yeah, this all makes sense. Rock, you could do rock crawling out there. And sure. oh yeah, and this is a this is a Impala SS or a Caprice. Dude, this guy's Impala Oh Hawk. yeah, yeah. This guy's a Chad. Yeah, nice collection. Physically identical to mine. Here is a 2000 Mazda MX-5 Miata, $8,991, 11 hours ago in Jacksonville, Florida. Clean Carfax, Mahogany Mica 2000 Miata. It's not a base. This has to be an SE to get that color. Five speed. It has to be a six speed to get this color. So I don't know what this is about. This looks like it was written by a dealer and it's also kind of parked in an office park, but he wants nine grand. It has 106,000 miles. It looks immaculate. Doesn't even it's, come with ants, probably. Probably doesn't even have ants. Mine had ants. Uh, or a speed hole. No speed holes. Well, maybe. <laughs> we, I don't know. We haven't looked at all the pictures. But uh, this is an SE. This will have the Torsen Limited Slip, the six-speed manual, and it's got the wooden interior, which I am not a big fan of. It's got the wooden Nardi, wooden e-brake, and, and wooden shift knob. There it is. Pretty rare stuff. Kind of nice. It doesn't feel good in the hand compared to leather. That's the real problem with it. Yeah, this looks really nice. $9,000 is probably exactly what it's worth, though. Yeah, I was going to say, like, it's... If you're looking for one, here it is. You're not yeah. getting a deal, but you're not getting completely host. No. You gotta really like purple to be rolling around in one of these, though. Gotta warn you. Here is a 1999 10th anniversary convertible. 120,000 miles. Runs excellent. One owner. Rare. Not many made. Uh, that is not true about Miatas. He must mean the, the package. <laughs> Six speed. Have all the service records. Just smoged. Smog- smogged. Must see. Make an offer. Smoged. <laughs> Didn't uh, the 10th anniversary come with like a toy car or a watch or something like that? I couldn't tell you. I want to say it did. But uh, here is one, and it looks like it's in excellent condition. Dude wants eleven five for it. If you're just trying to drive a car, I would recommend staying away from these anniversary editions and sh- because they're all owned by boomers who paid extra think, for that. Yeah, they think it makes it makes it more important. Yeah, and not much else to say about that one, so we'll move on. It's just too much. Yeah, I would agree. And something's up with the top, too. It's going to need a new top, and I guarantee you nobody's making this blue top anymore, so you're going to yeah. have to put a black one on there. I think uh, black would look better, honestly. Yeah, but then you lose apparently, the prestige of the 10th anniversary edition. Apparently, the the 10th anniversary was 6,500 bucks more than the base. Oh my god, dude! That it's like what the car costs new like 30 percent more. Yeah. yeah. Uh, no. Yep. It, I found the box. It came with a uh, a watch, uh, like a little toy car. You're paying eleven thousand five hundred dollars for a Mazda Miata with 120k on it, and you're not even getting the swag. In the you're not even getting the, the Hot Wheels. No. Yeah. It came with a little Hot Wheels, and it looks like a keychain, and... It's a uh, his and her watch. A his and a his, <laughs> a his awesome. and his watch. It's a tiny little picture, yeah. but you get the idea. Comes with a couple watches, uh, yeah, a little model of the car that you can put in your center console, and keychain, you said? I think that's a key fob, yeah. Well, all right. Well, that's, that's too damn much, dude. Saw the thing on Bring a Trailer. Find the toys first. Here is... <laughs> here's nice. a 99... 6800 bucks in Winter Garden, Florida, 12 hours ago with 116K on it. You'll notice most of these have really low mileage because they were bought by boomers. Like these yeah. are retiree vehicles. So they've been sitting in garages until this guy bought it, you know? I hate to say it, they all are when they're new. Oh, no, no. New Miatas? Yeah, that's explicitly a boomer car. Mm-hmm. Boomers love when, you know, like people between the ages of 18 to 49 call them g- incessantly on the internet <laughs> so here is one with 116k on it clean title this car has oem add-ons including who cares uh has the torsen lsd has the body kit maintenance has been done in the past seven months includes new clutch master slave cylinder valve cover gasket etc 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 done in the past 500 miles new coil pack spark plugs plug wires and oil change has a skunk two intake manifold racing beat headers isr short throw max peating rod coilovers gross aftermarket screen with backup camera 
doesn't mention the wheels. You're probably not getting them. Passenger window doesn't go down. Check engine light comes on every once in a while for O2 sensors. Soft plastic window has small hole that's been covered and is faded. Car will be sold with OEM steelies on as a tire has recently popped on the aftermarket wheels. And you can't just replace a tire. You have to take the wheels with you. So you're getting steelies. <laughs> I, I think he's saying that. It has one spare. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. So it's on it's Because I read three that too, and I was like, I was, I was about to say, like, this motherfucker, you pop one tire and you take all the wheels away? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my bad. So Although they must the be reps. the wheels kind of suck. The wheels do suck. That looks not good. The rest of the car looks great, except for this. The tan kind of kind of breaks it, but, you know, whatever. That's a personal Seat preference. covers are fringy. Oh, yeah. And who knows what's under there? Yeah, I wonder what those look like underneath. This doesn't look so bad. That's unfortunate that he went with the world's worst possible coilovers on it, but whatever. I love that it's a white flag, so the car is surrendering. <laughs> I'm glad he tested one cylinder. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, and I don't know what happened to his uh, steering wheel here. It looks like it's wrapped in some sort of carbon fiber vinyl. Yeah. I think it's a cover. Like a slip-on cover. Oh, yeah, it's like a giant Walmart cover, you're right. Yeah. Well, that comes right off. But anyway, aside from the wheels, I mean, it looks good, and the price isn't terrible, so... Go check it out. That's a that, that's a potential go check it out, although so many of these come up that you really could just wait for a good one to come along. You don't necessarily have to jump at it unless you need a car right now. And if you need a car right now, you don't buy a f***ing Miata. Buy an actual car. Don't listen to buy this it. guy. Go rip it, dude. <laughs> Buy that $2,000, uh, $2,500 prelude in Hawaii. There you go. Buy that instead. <laughs> oh, this one right here? 108,000 yeah. miles? Shh, dude, what's up with Damn. that? It's on. It's in Hawaii. Runs cherry. Safety is out of reg. Still good until the end of this month. Small, kind crack on windshield wipers. No work. Okay. All right. And back driver fender is dented and rusted a little bit. It's all it's fixable. Also car, also, car is stolen. <laughs> yeah. Oh, eh. For a $2,500 beater, you fuck it. That's yeah, amazing. I'd I'd uh, I'd pull the trigger on that um that round of Russian roulette if I had to. So if you're in, we're not even gonna try. If you're in Hawaii, go check that one out. Here is a 2000 Miata for 9750. Ten hours ago in Longwood, Florida. Har har har. Seventy thousand <laughs> like miles. Like a long. <laughs> you get yeah, it. it <laughs> <laughs> this is the only picture. It is at a. Buy here, pay here lot. Fast car it, connection. It says that it's an automatic. So I got to say no on this one. Yeah. No. It says well, five speed in the description, though. Why is it oh. impossible to get this right, dude? Why? Because Click if the, the dealer button. doesn't care, why should you? That's a good question. They hablamos espanol over there, they not can English. On this, they can hobble on this d dude. Here is a <laughs> 99 Miata for $4,000 five days ago in Bridgeville, Delaware. 106 k Classic Mazda Miata convertible runs great. Have all paperwork with clean title. Selling for down payment on our little home. Text or call. I don't do messenger. Hidden information. So he will never sell this car. Uh, but you can see some screenshots of it from his phone here. <laughs> and something little, says Republican. <laughs> little car, yeah. little home. Duh. He's, at, he's at Kent Kent County Republican headquarters with his Mazda Miata. So real boomer owned. And Bynum, he's buying a small house. Yeah, buying a tiny really home. small house. Yeah, I think we call those RVs. And here's an automatic <laughs> transmission. So, oh, uh, God. no way to contact this individual. Yeah, no thanks, Which... Renee. We're going to have to pass on that one. Fine by Is that me. How you say that? I think. I would assume That's... Renee. Runei. Ru Runei. Ren this message, how do you pronounce your name? But they'll never respond. Oh, I don't do messenger. <laughs> don't find out. That could be a lie. Yeah. And that would be a real good reason not to buy from her. She's a liar, dude. I don't buy from liars. God. 2003 Mazda Miata convertible, $9,000 a day ago in Spring, Texas with 135K on it and a Porsche stripe down the side. Selling oh, my 2003 geez. Miata LS NB2 five-speed manual factory LSD, 135K, clean title, original engine and transmission, cold AC, hot heat, no overheating. Everything works as it should. The engine mounts were replaced with innovative mounts. The shifter bushings and fluid were changed along with gear oil and diff fluid. Car runs great and smooth. Has a hard dog roll bar. NK PFO1s, which are like the what is it, CR Kai knockoff kind of, but made by NK. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's got yeah, some Indy, right. Indy 500s on it, some Connie struts, some FM sway bars, and it just goes on and on and on. Some FM sway bars, God. Yeah, and we got some pictures in the dark here. Yeah, kill yourself if you do that. Cool pick, but can't really see what you're trying to buy. I hate those roll bars. Paint looks good. So, I love those roll bars, dude. They look sick. You love sick. those bars? 
They'll Hard take dog? away all of the space that you can have inside of an MB, <laughs> which is none, but they do look cool as hell. I don't know, man. 9000 bucks. It's kind of set up for, you know, like some weekend fun. I think it looks pretty good. He's got the cool gauges. Yeah, those are interesting. Oh, yeah. I Like, I don't hate, like, he's got the Nardi and all, but, like, I don't hate the, like, little bit of mods he's done. Like, I'm not sold on the bar, but, like, you know. You hate, you hate these, like, purpose-built seats? Yeah. Why? If it's gonna be your, if it's gonna be your daily, those are uncomfortable as f- This ain't yeah, a daily. This is, uh, this is Safety Poochie talking here. If you're gonna be in a harness with a roll bar and no airbag, you're wearing a helmet and a Hans device. Or if you get in a wreck, you will snap your neck. Unless you're 5'3". Yeah. Three. In which case, maybe you'll be okay. But if you're over five, dude, if you're over five three, dude, you might be fucked. <laughs> yeah, I mean, li- realistically, I'm not even kidding. Like, this isn't cool. I mean, is it? Yes, is it not? No, but like, yeah, yeah. If you're just driving this daily and you get into a decent accident, um, fucking Renee. <laughs> no, no, uh, yeah, no, 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 no. You, you will be like, um, I just want to know how your name is pronounced. Yeah, why is she attacking you? Anyway, tell her, no, no, tell her stop gaslighting me. God. <laughs> we'll just be done with that one. <laughs> to add on to what Poochie's saying, like, if your head, like the back of your head is over this, you know, you snap your head back and hit that bar, and you're dead. You're fucking, Lights out. You're, yep. you're Hulk Hogan's kid's friend in the hospital with a dent in his head, you know? Like, <laughs> or, if you snap, or if your head goes forward, you're snapping your neck because there's no Hans device, or oh, you're yeah. eating that steering wheel. Yeah, it's just it's just a bad time all around. But if this is just a track car, then, you know, it's all good. But, but if it's, it's just a track car, there's too much stuff on this car to make it dailyable for it to be a track car. Exactly. Like, take if out the interior. If it's a track car, you're not running plastics. You're not running carpet. You know, you're not running a fucking radio, a head unit. You're not running yeah. a SpongeBob air freshener. <laughs> yeah. Guys, I'm I sorry suspect. about these squares who can't handle a car with a roll bar. No, no, no. Like, look, uh, all right, dude. It, it, I don't it's the, like it's it. A hard, like it's a hard, it's a hard pill to swallow, dude. Like, no, no, I don't. Like, I don't. You don't need to run a. I'm blue pilling myself on this, dude. That yeah, that one are. is fine, you know, because in all likelihood, you're probably never gonna hit that with your head. If you're in a position where you're hitting that with your head, you're dead anyway. Yeah. But like a full cage in a car, is is, is cringe. Yeah. No, if you put like gonna, a, like an eight point with like the. Like the bar. Yeah, the door yeah. bars and everything. Yeah. yeah. Oregon Coast Fire on YouTube says non-adjustable buckets. It's kind of cringe. And yeah, that's that's where I'm good getting at. You know, like I wouldn't want to no go reason. on a long drive in this now. No, there's no and there's no reason to put that in your in your street car. The reason you do it is because you is you want to LARP as a as a track car guy. I think this is probably a legit autocross guy. He's got all the parts. I don't think this is a, a poser. But what's the point of doing all that shit to your car and making it uncomfortable as fuck? Uh, well, it really all know. that shit. I'm, I'm really just talking about the seats. What's the point of, of having those super uncomfortable seats so you can drive in a parking lot once every month? That's it. That's the point. That's, that wouldn't be the first time. That like, happened. what's the point of buying CS:GO skins? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> what Hell you yeah. gain, what you gain on the autocross course with those uncomfortable fixed buckets, you lose so much more. We're gonna have to agree or disagree on this one, but I'll leave it all in. What do you think that SpongeBob little tree smells like, though? Vanilla, for sure. Low, low tide. <laughs> so it doesn't smell like a sponge, like an old Burger. sponge. <laughs> it just smells like dish detergent. Yeah. Cra- <laughs> Krabby Patty. Like Here is a 99 Miata, 6,500 bucks, Columbus, Ohio, a day ago. Hundred, damn it, Renee. 99 Mazda Miata, 6,500 bucks, day ago in Columbus, 160,000 miles manual transmission. Let's say 99 NB1 with an NB2 facelift, 160K. Original engine, fresh gaskets, and timing belt at 146K. Never drifted. The upgrade list is nearly endless, so I'll <laughs> stick to the main. We don't need to, to read Never any drifted. of that. You can't drift no. those. And how is the upgrade list nearly endless? Like, shut the f*** up. Oh, airbag's blown. Rip. Rip. All right, yes. that, expl- that explains the facelift, by the way. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, f- cool wheel, dude. Oh, sh. Damn. Damn cosmic, bro. Yoga pants wheel. You're getting called out, Netgear. Netgear has not been to an SCCA event, and it shows. Damn. Ooh. <laughs> he's going to get okay. heated, dude. No, he's, he, he doesn't care. You um, need a fix. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go off, King. Here is a 2004 Miata Mazda Speed for 12 grand two days ago in Oviedo, Florida. 130,000 miles, or Oviedo, Florida, perhaps. This is number 3,129 of 5,300 made in 04 to 05 before the plant burned down. This is <laughs> which, is, which is true. Is that why they stopped making them? <laughs> yeah. Th- that's, yeah. Oh, okay. They had a small fire. Did not a know that. second plane has hit the plant. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> No, that's a thermal event. Get it straight, guys. Anyway, um, <laughs> isn't the NC a better power to weight 
ratio than the NB Again, the NC is a best driving car just in general. It just suffers from an appearance problem. Yeah. It, so see, really quick, the NA is too expensive and crappy. The NB is the one to buy if you're broke. The NC is the one to buy if you have a little money to spend and you want a Miata. And the ND is if you get if you want like, you know, a new car with a warranty in it to be quicker. I would you argue get, that the NA through NC are all the same price now, but uh, please continue. Uh, no. NC, I think, is a little more than the NB, but it's worth it. Yeah, and, yeah, I, yeah. I, I would think the NB is the bottom bottom of the barrel. Price wise, or yeah, yeah, yeah price yeah, wise, com- completely yeah. price wise. Yeah, but you could probably find a cheap NC though. I'm not not saying that's what I'm could. saying. Like I'm, I'm pretty confident but, and, you can but, find but yourself a cheap NC. Basing it on 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 it being a newer car. Yeah, yeah. So this one's got some shit done to it. It has a rebuilt title on it. it has 130k. Can't really see anything that really screams salvage title, but it's got one. Um, yeah, oh, the guy says do just theft recovery out of a ditch. So like, um, I don't know. Yeah, I would just yeah. put the interior back together. Yeah, nothing structurally maybe, wrong. With maybe the car. maybe a control arm or something. Yeah, could be legit. How could much be. is it? So 130k for 12 grand on a salvage title? No thanks. Yeah, this is like five thousand dollars more than an NC that would blow the doors okay. off of it. Let's put put a pin in that and let's go to bat and look up Mazda Speed Miatas. Yeah, I see. And that's the thing. Like, that gives me beyond to a point. Like, it, it, if this is priced appropriately for a salvage title, maybe. But, like, because it's a Mazda Speed, it means it makes a little bit more money than most MPs. But at the same time, like, it's still a salvage title. I do love the orange Miata, though. I do love the, the orange. The orange MP. is really good. Yeah. Mazda Sneed. Almost every single one sold on here is a Mazda Speed. So here's the most recent. Oh, yeah. Eat a fucking. Dude, you're Se- kid. 73 so less miles and My. not salvage. Yeah. So there you go. Uh, probably not a great deal. Moving on. Oh, like 10 15, grand. Maybe. There was a 15,000 one for 19 grand. 15,000 mile. 15,000? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So like 10 grand is the number on yeah. that. Oh, like not that yeah, much more. dude. Get out of here. <laughs> yeah. And also, just, just buy an NC. And here for is... For real. Here is a 2004 for 15890 two days ago in Longwood, Florida. Didn't we just look at one in Longwood? Yeah. Is this the same one? I remember one? because of the dick. No, it's a different one. Yeah. All right. Well, this is a completely different car in the same hilariously named city in Florida. This has a manual transmission, only 63K. Clean title, rare on a Miata, apparently. Good condition for the year end miles. Clean Carfax, no accidents. Price includes dealer fees. Okay. Well, too six, much. Sixteen thousand yeah. dollars. No problem. I'll, I'll 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 go to bat, buy a Mazda Speed, and I won't have a fucking grandma's fucking bathroom doorknob shifter. <laughs> the diamond <laughs> shifter. Well, like, yeah. this is almost a twenty-year-old car, and they want sixteen grand for it. And I'm Not pretty even. sure those are seat covers, and this is just the base trim too. Sus. This is an insane ask for for this car. Yeah. Yeah. Because in 04, if it had leather, it would have heated seats, I think. So, yeah. What's, yeah. Up, with the, what's up with the back window? What does it look like that? Is that a plastic yeah. rear window? No, it's a glass. The glass one has like a, well, maybe they changed the design. I think they changed the design to where, like on mine, it's a, it's a separate piece. Like the, the middle is like a flap. It's not like one big solid, whatever. It's, it's probably OEM. Never mind. Um, yeah, too much. All right. We got uh, everybody's favorite. We got the luggage yeah. rack. yeah. I, I, I like the luggage 5, bucks, Scottsboro, Alabama, 118K manual. Uh, lowest I'm willing to go is 5,000 or best offer. We'll trade for an 05 okay. to 07 Mustang. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 05 so to 07. That's like smack in the new edge years? No. Yeah. No, that's, is, that's the yeah, no, that's first years of um, the S197. Yeah. yeah, that's it. New Edge ends in 04. Lowest I'm willing to go is $5,000 or best offer. Okay. <laughs> I'm willing to <laughs> low, go as low as you want to. Yeah, yeah, you can't. I'm willing to go as low as 5000 or what the next person will offer. <laughs> yeah. And he's got 118K on it. Yeah, it looks pretty all right. Seat's a little looks crusty. Like a high school kid is yeah. selling this thing. This would be a good little high school kid car. Yeah. Lucas in, uh, in YouTube says, why list for 5,500 if you're saying you'll take 5,000? And we talked about this last time. It's like, yeah, you're just a fucking brain dead moron. Because if you put the price, if you put $10,000 and then on the bottom, lowest I'll take is, is 9,000. <laughs> Guess what, motherfucker? No one is giving you $10,000. Yeah. No one is going to say, oh, yeah, I'll give you asking. I'll give you 10,000 for it. Unless people are going to look at it because you're asking more, you know, like the lower your ask is, unless it's one, two, three, four, you know, in which case, whatever. fuck yourself. Yeah. Then, yeah, then yeah, you're yeah, just also an fuck idiot. There yeah. too. In podcast chat, Bobby, Bobby Sausage. Yo, sheesh. Yeah, yeah, let's see that. that. Got an N.A. Like, on it's some, pretty, it's pretty some, some tri-spokes. Yeah, this guy's tri-spokes. Yeah. Got the hard top. 
I mean, they're not ad vans and the hard tops wrong color, but you know, all right. Yeah, it sucks about where he lives. I mean, if that is that black, <laughs> then you're fine. If it's a mismatched black top, yeah, paint black, <laughs> whatever. It kind of looks yeah, like it's like it? a blue metallic or something. But like yeah, I said, like Bobby, Galaxy. they're not ad vans, so they're, fine. Excuse me, these are Ray's Mazda Speed MSO threes. The only tri spokes we recognize here are the ad vans. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> or or Prime. Yeah, I was gonna say or Prime wheels. <laughs> 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 Here's another 2002 Mazda Miata at a dealership. Seven thousand dollars, Florence, Alabama. One hundred forty thousand miles. New tires, automatic. We're done. We're done here. Seven thousand dollar automatic Miata. Nope. Looks nice on the outside. Looks mega cringe on the inside. Ooh, yeah, the shift is just so bad. Wow, wow that automatic I tell you though, shifter just. Looks, I would. Ugh. I'd love to have a, an auto detailing place like this. You just want you want to just detail cars? Yeah, like that full service auto detailing mm-hmm. with full release, full oh. body auto detailing. Okay. <laughs> no, so it gotta, would be lit. You got to go inside, or you do it in the car, and whatever you want, dude. Oh, okay. Yeah, and like, the price no, is but, right. But, but do you come to but me? But legit, I would, I would like, I would like, I would like to do that. But the thing is, no one wants to pay what the work is actually worth, and that's what sucks. Yeah, like it's a lot of fucking work. You know, yeah. if you want to get if you want to get a paint correction, it's a lot of fucking work, yeah. and you're gonna have to pay for it. But it's tough, you know. It's hard out there for a pimp. I, I hear it, dude. Clean dance yeah. out of mine. That took that took hours. If it was billable, <laughs> ooh, I'd be fucked. Here yeah. is a '99 Miata, five thousand bucks, Columbus, Indiana, one hundred twelve thousand miles. So my daughter is wanting to try and sell her car. She has wrecked it. The airbags did deploy, but it is still working fine. The engine and transmission have no issues, and it's pretty. It's still very much drivable. It has a hard top and a soft top, although the soft top has a tear. It was like that when she bought it. it she's been offered $3,500 just for the hard top alone, but would like to try and sell the car altogether first, asking 5000 OBO, willing to sell the hard top for $3,000 firm. It will not respond to offers lower. If you were offered $3,500 for the hard top, why didn't you take why it? Why yeah, do you want $3,000 now? Don't, motherfucker. <laughs> nice basketball hoop, <laughs> idiot. <laughs> it's easier to dunk when it's like that. Yeah, dunk on this dude all day, dude. This sucks. With a fucking bunged Ooh, up nice. hard top. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, nah, this is... Uh, go, ahead, go ahead. Wait, what's he want for this? Because if it's anything over three grand, it's too much. Five grand. Five. Oh. No. I would offer him three. <laughs> the, the the top really is worth somewhere around three. I think three is even asking no, a little bit too much. No, absolutely not. No, like no, 1,500, the are... two grand. No, they're up, dude. They're they're going for more. Well, it is the top the same as the NA top? Yes. Okay, no, then yeah. Yeah, they'll yeah. fit on in there too. I think I like twenty five hundred yeah, is probably right. average. Yeah, twenty five to three thousand, sure. That's Send him a message. Insane. Tell him. Although, tell him also, Bo- oh god. Tell him Bobby Sausage says to pick up your fucking net. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby Sausage says pick up He's, your net. It's really upset about this. And also, it, the top's actually not in that good condition. It looks like it's pretty majorly scuffed here. Yeah, from something. No, it's not yeah. mint. Not Look, yeah, the fucking clear is peeling. This is stupid. I think the, I think the net this makes me the angry. This makes me legitimately angry. Here is a 2003. That is a that is a hell of a color. All right, 2003 Miata, 7,500 bucks in Croydon, Pennsylvania, 925,000 miles. New tires, no. brake covers. Oh, the headlight covers are heinous. Yes, those are terrible. Uh, 2003 Ew. Miata convertible, new tires, new brake rotors, nice running car. Don't want to sell, but don't need it. Got new car, 7,500 OBO or trade. And it's resprayed. It's on the, um, I believe these are the uh, Shinka edition or Shinzen. I'm, I'm not, it's one of those two. But the car's fucked. It looks like it actually is uh, either a Shinka or Shinzen. I can't remember which is which. One's an RX8, one's a Miata. Uh, it's just an SE. It's an automatic. How the, f- how the fuck does this dude get <laughs> good humor edition panel? floor mats? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just I'm just thinking in so it's 92k not 925 that door has been fucked Look yeah. at it has Edge. the rot yeah yeah no, just roll right. to the paint shop and say hey man give me that grimace look <laughs> say less but yeah Same. there was duct tape there was duct tape on the door panel holding it on this thing sucks <laughs> oof this is reminding me why I gave up looking for Miatas because it's just so much of this yeah, there's some good ones in there though. I mean, you do have to sift through some trash, but I mean, they're they're out yeah, there. So yeah, but that's much the thing, trash. though. Like, but when you when you're looking for cheap cars, you're gonna run into cheap people, and that's that's yeah. the thing. These haven't been that bad. Like, how many cars have we looked at where every single one was dick? Plenty, plenty for sure. Yeah. Well, that's gonna do it for the NB Miata. We didn't really find anything worth buying today. But, Whoever uh, wanted us to could. look at these, go f- yourself. Yeah, but, yeah, for real. It's now done. I'm just 
angry. You've ruined my evening. Thank you. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined.